What up? My name is Brad. Welcome back to Dragon Ball Legends. Today we're taking a look at Nappa 398%, both the hero and the extreme. Now a couple of units do transcend their ranking, you know, so if you have a hero, some heroes are as good as extremes, and some extremes are as good as sparkings, which is awesome. I feel like this Nappa is, and the hero one's not bad either. We'll take a look at their stats, do a little more in depth, do a little bit of PvP, see how they really do. But if you enjoy Dragon Ball Legends content, make sure you go down below, subscribe to the channel. Now, I'm going to bring it back. You know, we have the gift cards again. So, being sub to the channel, leaving a like on the video, and let me know in the comment section to use Google Play or to use Android. I'll go through every other week, and we'll pick a winner for it. They'll win either a Google Play card or an iTunes card. It was a good way to grow the channel. You guys seem to really like it, so it's back. Let me know down below to use Google Play or to use uh, iPhone, <laughs> Apple, and uh, let me know anything about the characters, too. If you do enjoy the 398s, like the video. Set of the channel. Let's check it out. Okay, so this is one of the few times I'm going to tell you I don't actually like this art that much. It's just too much there. With that said, it looks nice. It's just there's too much happening. He's too big of a son of a gun. So I'm not a giant, giant fan of Nappa in this game. Uh, I'm not a giant fan of Nappa in general, personally. Uh, he's funny as hell in Team Four Star. We all know that. But when it comes to Legends and Budokai and all those things, he's been just okay. You know what I mean? Nappa's not meant to be that kind of character. When it comes to statistics, that's where Nappa in this game is hitting hard. 57,000? That's almost 60k, bro. Yeah, I mean, the, okay, so the blast attack is terrible. And you can see where he gets his high attack is by lowering his defense and his blast is being terrible. So you don't want to hit on the blast side, which does kind of suck that he does get a blast card as one of his things. But what are you going to do, you know? can't. Every unit can't be perfect. But 57,000 is right below Trunks and Goten. Uh... Super Trunks and Kid Goten, right below them. So that's really, really good damage. On top of that, he does have a lot of ways to buff it. So form of attack, 15% to damage inflicted, perfect. Nice little solid, per solid percentage, plus damage inflicted. Good, 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 good on that one. Outrageous health, plus 35% key restoration. No complaints. 17 timer counts, a weird ass number, but I'm down. <laughs> it is what it is. 70% uh, damage inflicted to yellow. That's a big one. That's a really good one too. It gives him a nice, you're facing a yellow unit, they're taking some damage. It's good. And it, parts, it partners him well on a team with two purples. You can pop him on a team with two purples and he can really make up that damage because it helps everybody do more damage to yellows. So I like that, no complaints. Vegeta on your team, which we do have a Vegeta on our team. 20% strike damage, doesn't matter the Vegeta, just Vegeta. Good, 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 good. No complaints. Uh, Anti-San Diego, so reduce damage. He doesn't like going to San Diego. A lot of people blow up in San Diego. I don't know. There's not many self-destructs in San Diego, so I don't know. <laughs> the joke ran out real fast, but he does reduce that simply because of the TV show, Chiaotsu blowing up, yada, yada, yada. 15% to strike inflicted. So when you really get Nappa popping off, really, really good. He is a good lead character, being red as well. Uh, you don't have a whole lot of blues running the meta right now. There's a couple. Blue Ku can really... Blue Ku can destroy anybody, <laughs> but, but Nappa is a good lead. For 20 timer counts, he does get that buff to it. Taking a look at Giant Storm, it's one of those undodgeable ones, which you can kind of tell the undodgeables by the two, the six red boxes, and you have the one in front of it. So that should, I believe it hits from right when you start the battle. So you could technically lead with that if you see they're going for a strike, but you kind of want to dodge and then click it so they can't dodge and start attacking you again. You'll see more on the obviously PvP part. Cause it to receive 10% more self-destruct. So he partners pretty well with 16, actually. Uh, to, and he partners against 16 as well. He fights against him very well, too, because he takes less damage. So you want, he's, you're not going to pop Nappa with 16's ability unless he's under, like, 50%. Then you might still pop him, but it's going to be pretty tough. He's okay. He's pretty good. Nappa's not bad. Uh, Hero Nappa, not going to be quite as powerful, of course. So take a look at him right here. We do have 15% to purple, so awesome. He gets a boost to purple as well. It's a nice little one. Again, you can throw him on a team. What is purple weak against? Red, which is good against... Uh, no, no, no. What's purple weak against red? I don't know. Whatever. You can throw him on a team that does benefit, that needs that purple damage. So a team with two greens, not a bad idea. It does work pretty well. You can get more damage. If anything, it's nice to throw him... So these are the units that help you do like the 2 million damage. You want to throw them in the background as long as you're fighting that type. Because getting that additional 15%, that's a big amount on a Rising Rush. Take my word for it. Plus 40% to strike damage. 40% for a hero unit. Even if his stats, which 
really aren't that bad. 41 and 42, that's a massive damage. 40% is like sparking level damage. So, no complaints there. I do like that. Team Vegeta, blast attack up. It's a bit weird that it's blast attack, but he'd be a little too good for a hero unit if it was strike attack, truthfully. You just put him with a Vegeta and both those Nappas are just going ham. So, uh, anti San Diego, he does, he does have the same thing. Reduced damage received by self destructs by 50%. So, he does again go well against 16, but there's not too many units. 16 and Chao Tzu. Obviously, other units do explode damage, but I mean, that literally explode to do a lot of their damage. Cybermen. Um, he does reduce Cyberman damage, so that's kind of cool, I guess. I don't, I don't think I've ever fought a Cyberman besides me using one on PvP. Maybe when the game first came out. Plus 10% to strike and blast damage, so no, ov not overall damage. The way that I read that, I don't know, let me know if you know. Does that mean, so that's your overall attacks is plus 10%, and then when you get the plus damage inflicted, that's when you also do your standard punches, right? And your little key blast. That should be full on damage. I could be wrong. I don't know why they would word it differently, but... Either way, like I said, take a look over here. Okay, health. For a Huion, it's really good health. But 41, 42, 30, and 29. Not too bad. His strike defense is okay. A little bit higher. Uh, he is obviously saying he does get two fists, which does benefit the other Nappa very nicely. Because like I said, the other Nappa does have one blast, so not as great. He fits out a Frieza Force team. So does the other one. That does fit really, really well, too. I do like that. You can throw him onto a Frieza Force team with uh, Ginyu. It's not terrible. You know, I don't necessarily recommend... If you're going to pick one of the Nappas, use the Extreme Nappa, but using them both, if you're just really feeling a Nappa kind of day, then yeah, <laughs> throw them on a Frieza Force team. Uh, the team that I decided to throw them on, no, no, is this one right here. I could not decide what Vegeta I wanted to use. I was really thinking Super Vegeta, and then I was like, I don't want to have another freaking yellow with a yellow and then a red, and then a blue comes through and just runs us over. And I didn't want to do the other two where I have two reds and then a yellow, and it's like, ah, like the Super Saiyan Vegeta. As a sparking, so I was like, you know what? This is a pretty good one. Mine is six stars, so he does hit really, really, really tough. Uh, Scout of Vegeta has been good since the day the game came out. He's just hits like a truck. He just takes no. Oh god, he takes no hits. <laughs> but this is the team we're rocking out with. Obviously, the guys in the bottom. I put the blue Goku there strictly because he does benefit everybody 27% to strike. And then you have Super Saiyan Vegeta benefits the red one. Super Saiyan Goku benefits the yellow one. Best team I could really come up with for Nappa. Um. You gotta remember it's Nappa, so. <laughs> I don't, I never expect a whole lot using heroes, but I really know that Extreme Nappa can hit like a truck. Like, there's a couple units, like I said. Even Raccoon on the Ginyu Force is a hero. I think he has like 58,000 strike attack. That's crazy, that's just wild strike attack. So, there's a couple units here and there that can really just transcend it, so to speak. Ooh, this is a good team to fight. I like his Z equipment on his Gogeta. I've been trying hard, man, to get that Z equipment. It's tough. Mm, I see that blue Goku. <laughs> that blue Goku, is a, he's a tough one, man. We're going to lead the yellow one. Put Vegeta in the middle, and then I want to leave the red for last. Yeah, I think that's best. I think that's best to do. Breaking down their stats, we're going to rely on the red. I, I know at the beginning of the battle, the red one does get his uh, buff, but it's like I still... It's not as important a buff to just kill him right off. I feel like he's going to have to lead a... He may not lead a blue unit. I don't know. Scout of Vegeta's not defensive enough to be able to swap in, so... It makes it a bit tough. He did lead a blue unit, so I'm glad I didn't lead that. Get your dodge on. That's fine. Um, we'll swap. I'm going to have to tank that damage. Hoo, 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 hoo. You can see... You can see those defenses. Oh my gosh. Here. Okay, you didn't go for that. Oh, bro... You ever notice that Goten and Nappa throw key blasts the same way? <laughs> I don't know why, I just I just think it's funny. Move over to the side. Give me this. Let's charge him. Okay, good. Now we can sit in the yellow one. Give me some nice damage for a sec. That's some solid damage. I have no complaints with that. I didn't use my Vanish yet. But that's some good damage from a hero unit. Do I expect a whole lot here? No, I don't. We're going to try right now to get a Rising Rush. Oh, I did not mean to click it. No, you got to get out of there, man. You got to get out of there. I'm sorry. They're just not going to compete with Gogeta's stats. I mean, that's just how it is. You know, if you expect it otherwise, <laughs> not a whole lot I can tell you. Pretty much this video is just... I make these videos just to show you guys what they overall can do. Am I guaranteeing that they're going to be good? Of course not. Up. Whoop. Ah, damn, dude. 
On video, I can never nail those. You may as well just kill off him. That's fine. Okay, we're kind of we're kind of backed into the corner right now. Woo, okay, did not expect that, but that's fine. I'm just gonna let you kill. Gogeta's is too powerful for a couple of these units to handle. He just he racks up damage like crazy. It's just too much. The whole point. Of, we're just gonna show you guys pretty much. I'm just gonna show you guys the rising rush. There's not a whole lot else to show you. <laughs> Because you're not going to put it, this isn't the ideal team. You, know? you don't want to show off both Nappas. Normally you would just put this red one on a team. I mean, we're going to show off Resisted if I, if I can get a hit. He's just going to kill me. Alright, well just kill me then, that's fine. You can see the defenses play a big part with Nappa. Big part. You got to have some bulk. You got to have some bulk like some Bardock and some 16 sitting behind him to switch into to take those hits. Not Scout of Vegeta and another Nappa. <laughs> but that's okay. It's no biggie. It's no biggie. I kind of want to fight hybrids with this team. I feel like they could do some good damage. Hybrids aren't amazing on defense. Gogeta is just stupid good. He really is. I, I love him. It's really fun to play with him, but it's like... This is what you're playing with. <laughs> like, that's it. Uh, we'll leave the red one on this one. Because I don't... Freaking Piccolo, dude. There's a couple units, man. Piccolo's the same way. They got rid of the green one being busted. They're like, yeah, okay, he's just kind of mediocre now. Here's another one, and it's like, god damn, why is Piccolo so good? Every every incarnation of Piccolo in this game is just beast. And I use him too. I just pick your team in 17. Thank you. <laughs> it's like, bruh, it's not a hard decision. You know the three units you're primarily using. All right, you don't really want to make a team that has... You can use all six. You want to have your main three and just not the enemy not know which one you're going to use. I guess he's doing it right. Hey, yo, thank you, man. Appreciate that. If you want to follow me on Twitch, feel free to. Radical YT. Okay. Well, what are you you gotta, we, we have to get in there for an actual hit. There we go. Look at this damage. Actually, that's good damage. It's not even like a joke kind of damage. We're going to swap out and go like this because then he won't be able to dodge it. I'm actually, I'm okay with a lot of that damage we just did. Let's go out right there. Sneaky bitch when they move just a little bit and it's like, god damn, dude. The amount of control you have over your characters is wild. I do not. Oh, Scout of Vegeta. <sighs> yeah, no, just keep doing your damage, bro. Come on, please fall for the dodge. Damn it. Okay, no, we're not doing this. Okay. Ugh, swab my character, bro. Now, we're gonna swap out right here. At least Scout of Vegeta can make up for a little bit of the damage, so that is good. I have no complaints over that. Hopefully we can get into this now. I really wish you hadn't popped that first, Brad. Talking to myself here, I'm sorry. Go out. I think Nappa... Okay, Nappa can't do enough damage to overcome it. He does a good amount, but not enough to overcome. Good, 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 good. I guess I didn't get that fast enough. Holy Jesus, dude. Get out of here, Piccolo. The amount of damage is just insanity, dude. That Piccolo is so damn good. And then Gogeta freaking heals and everything. Oh, you should have given me that dodge. Fuck you. It's my one of the video. You should have given me that dodge. No, just, I don't care. Just miss it. No? Okay, or don't. Okay, I'm gonna try and get dodged by whatever attack he throws at me. Or just dead. I'm gonna try to die too, whatever, dude. Yeah, then I get to go into my yellow unit. Thank you, that's fantastic. I do appreciate it. Now, we're doing this. Swapping. Going like this. Who are you gonna send in to take this hit? I was really hoping he was gonna send in Janimba. That was kind of the plan there. <laughs> uh, three blasts, dude? Piss off. Like, I know I'm using Scatter Vegeta, but it's like, alright. Mash me anyway, so it's fine. Just kill him. I don't. Just, go, go, Gita. Just kill him. <sighs> oh, fuck off. All right. Okay. We gotta get our head on straight. Okay. Whoop. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Just fucking. Yeah. I guess. Yeah. That, I'm not allowed that dodge. Sorry. My bad. Just kill him. I don't care. That's a really weird pose. Just kill him. I don't care. <laughs> Ugh, Gogeta, dude, he just, he doesn't ruin everything, but it's like, I can't do any showcases. I get it, you guys like Gogeta, same. Stop. <laughs> like, stop. Alright. 
just makes it really hard to showcase units when it's like they they are not they are not in this meta. <laughs> this is all right. Well, at least we can show you. I can show you a rising rush with uh. We'll we'll do this uh, extreme Napa. We'll get a sparking Napa one day. Maybe I don't know. I don't know. There's any good Napas in Dokken, so I don't know if they even actually care about Napa. Jim with two M's. Do what you do, man. Do what you do. Oh, you it's, it's just a bot, I know. Oh, hey, look, you guys can see the damage. It's like, I know it's a bot with no equipment, but... Shut up, okay? You get it. We do still have our dodge, which is nice. That torrential power. Torrential power, sorry. Um... I'm actually gonna go out, because I want to show... Resisted. Alright, bot. Okay, bot. Yeah, no, I didn't realize... Get... No, stop. Stop. That's how it starts to feel. It's like, stop it. <laughs> You're a bot. I'm not gonna fight like 100% series against you. Stop. Here we go. All right, yellow nap. We're putting the work in for a minute. Hmm. Let me dodge. I mean, giant storm is great because you can just throw it in like that, dude. That's a lot of damage. Uh, give me this. I'm gonna pop this. I'm gonna try and get this attack. Pop my ability and go. I forget the ability doesn't benefit strike. Three blasts again. Okay. Yeah, I mean, three blasts, you know, that's that's what we're showing off today, so. <laughs> now just imagine I was using three strikes. Give this like a 30% boost to what the actual damage is. I'm gonna assume we could hit 1.5 with three strikes. Against a bot, that means you could roughly hit a million against a sparking. I have no complaints of that. Now, a sparking that's very defensive, not so much, but if you're hitting a yellow unit, definitely you could hit a million. Wouldn't even be an issue, because he does have that additional damage towards it. Uh, we're 17 minutes, we're going for one more. Because I want to show a actual Rising Rush, not a bot. There's going to be a Gogeta on this team. In case you were wondering, I know you're like, huh? There's going to be a Gogeta on this team. <laughs> There's definitely going to. Oh, look at that! Wow, Gogeta, I've never played against him. I get it, I do. I'm just being snarky, because I do get it. Of course you want to use a Gogeta. At least his equipment's bad, so. Carlos, there is a chance here. <sighs> I say there's a chance here, but <laughs> who knows? <laughs> you know, and like I said, I say it, but it's like, dude, Gogeta's damage output is just stupid. It, it's just, once you get moving, it's real hard to counter that Gogeta lead. As a saying, you're stupid. Real hard. Specifically with these two units as well. I'm gonna go to the yellow one so we can get at least a nice clean swap into our red if we need to. Ooh, that's not a lot of damage. Alright, let's jump off though. Pop this ability. Go for this. You can go ahead, use your vanish. Oh, get out of there. Okay, here's some good damage. Give me a little bit of charge. I won't back out. I won't back out. I won't back out. <laughs> Let me back out. <laughs> like, stop. <laughs> It's like, no, no, you're staying in here. You have to land two hits before you can swap. It's like, hold on. Just let me out, dude. Nappa got scared for a minute there. Same here, though. Hey, it worked. Go, 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 Nappa, go. <laughs> go, go, go. <sighs> okay, let me swap out again. Give me this. Give me this. I need to get that key restoration. Perfect. Hmm, I'm down. Swap in your Bardock. That might have just caused me to miss this. Okay. Oh, I want to pick that blast. I'm going to pick the blast. Shh. I want to make sure Gogeta dies and we do a bunch of damage. Son of a... Okay. No, it's 25%, Brad. Shut up. I know it's 25%. Get out of there. Can't. can't. Like, I know it's 25%, but it's like, bro, it does not feel like that. It feels like 5%. Oh, my gosh. That damage... Gogeta just not... He just gave me a new life. Um, we're gonna stay for a sec. Okay, I Thank you. <laughs> it's like, I don't know what else to do besides just make random noises. <laughs> As you guys can see, Scatter Vegeta does put up a lot of damage. You know, in case you guys were wondering. Okay, give me this. No, 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 no. We should be able to kill from that. And I was like, we should be able to kill from that. Give me this. I want my damage increase. You can throw a little ball at me. I'm gonna strike attack me. One, two. He doesn't suck as bad as me. 
Okay, um, oh goodness. I'm actually gonna swap out because we can't take that kind of damage. I'm sorry, Red Nappa. You already showed your Rising Rush though, so it's okay. Good. <laughs> Alright, dude, like I said, man, you can see Scout of Vegeta really puts these numbers up here. That sucks. Um, I think I actually gotta. I gotta sack off the other one. I'm sorry, guys. You get to see how well he can tank. We'll give a fist. <laughs> There's no chance that this Napa would come back against a Bardock. Scout of Vegeta can barely come, can barely come back against a Bardock. Let alone Hero Napa. <laughs> 1.7 million damage on neutral. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, he may as well lock me in here. I, I feel it. We gotta go for this. We gotta go for this. I think I'm gonna miss it, though. Don't miss it. I'm picking Blast again, okay? If you pick Blast again, you bamboozled me. You got me, man. You son of a bitch. Alright. <laughs> I mean, I think we're dead. With his 40% buff, dude, Scout of Vegeta cannot take these hits. Yeah, Scout of Vegeta is just way too much of a glass cannon. You gotta have heavy defenses to even do anything against him. Or to maintain any attacks. Alright, Carlos, you got the win on that one, man. But anyways, that is the showcase. Now, it, as bad as it is with these hero and extreme units, that is relatively accurate. I mean, that's about how it goes most of the time using a hero unit. Extreme Nappa can definitely be thrown into some teams. The only problem is being with Vegeta. Because you got to have that Vegeta. So you could do, you know, Nappa, and then you would have, uh, what's his name? Super Saiyan Vegeta. And then you want to counter the blue unit they would have, Barok. That's a good Saiyan team. It would actually work in, in an ideal, would you ever pick Nappa over Gogeta? No. I mean, I'm going to be real honest with you on that one. No. But... He's kind of fun to throw in there every now and again. At seven stars, he'll be hitting pretty tough. He'll be getting really close at 60k. So I got no complaints with it. Overall, fun units. Not a problem using them. It's just, don't expect a lot from a hero unit. And most extremes can put the work in, but it's like, are you going to actually use them if you have Gogeta? No. If you just started the game, hell yeah, dude. Use Extreme Nappa. He is fantastic if you just started the game. Anyways, I'm going to leave that. Thank you so much for watching. Have yourself a great day. I will catch you in the next video. Deuces. better show me a real good time! <laughs>